to pair your PS3 style controller, simply connect the USB lead at both ends and you will see from the flashing LEDs it is connected. The screen shows us it's connected. Now wait five seconds and disconnect the lead. It will say it's disconnected and now connected via Bluetooth completely wirelessly. You have now paired this controller. To pair your PS4 style controller, firstly connect it to the console using the supplied USB lead and we should see it recognized by the system. Now we press options to bring up this menu. From here, go to controller and Bluetooth settings and press the south button. From here, go to pair Bluetooth pads automatically and press the south button. And we can see it's now scanning for Bluetooth devices. So remove the lead from the controller and hold home and share for five seconds. The device is shown as paired when you get two steady blue lights and we can control it without the lead plugged in. To connect your Switch style controller, firstly, connect it to the console using the supplied lead. And you'll see it has registered with the console. Might show as an Xbox 360 pad, but that's okay. Then press the plus button to bring this menu up. Go down to controller and Bluetooth settings, and then go to pair Bluetooth pads automatically and select that. You can see the system is now searching for Bluetooth devices. So remove the lead from the controller and hold the home and Y button and the green lights will begin to flash. You can release when the light goes steady and it shows that the controller has been paired without the wire. You can now quit out and play. Now with some controllers, they need remapping. Some of the switch controllers need remapping particularly. So this one does, and that's a very easy thing to do. So go to controller mapping, sometimes the sticks get transposed and things like that. So if that's not correct, go to controller mapping and find the button to activate. Okay, controller mapping. It's telling us now to hold a button. Hold the button on the Pro Controller and then just follow the procedure shown on the screen there. South, East, North, West, start, select, D-pad up, D-pad down, D-pad left, D-pad right, left shoulder, right shoulder, left analog up, left analog left, right analog up, right analog left, left trigger, right trigger, left stick press, right stick press and your hotkey. Okay, and then you can back out with the East button and we're golden. Procedure complete. Now, if for any reason your controller fails to pair or you're having problems with it, here's the procedure to troubleshoot. So connect your controller with the lead and that will guarantee a connection. And then press options and then go to controller and Bluetooth settings and then go to forget a Bluetooth device and then remove all. All Bluetooth devices have been deleted and now reconnect the controller with the wire and we can accept that. Now importantly to make sure those changes have taken effect restart the system and repeat the pairing procedure.